Welcome to another Smart Finder course. Today we're going to be teaching on how to create a carousel pin on Pinterest with multiple pins. Before we get started, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that every time we post a video, you can be notified. With that said, let's get started. So we're going to start by building our pins on Canva. And if you don't have a Canva account, you can open a free version. And within the free version, we can um, basically open a series of pins, or create us, our pins on, on Canva. And then we transfer it over to Pinterest. So in within Canva, you have the option to customize your pins and create new pins so for example if we want to create a basic pin we just basically um, click on one of the templates this is one that we recently used and within this template you can change your your pin so for editors say how how to write a blog for example and we can change the uh, branding to say art smart finders dot org you can also change the color uh, once you click on the pin itself it says okay let's see if we want to change the color from say from white to black then you get a full black background or if you want to use the light gray and then uh, you can add your own pictures based on the elements that are here you can add a photo supposedly you don't really want to to use a photo that's there you can you can go into the photo library and if you see one that looks a little bit better for example if we want that one we click on it and we can just um, either right mouse click and replace the background or we can just drag it so it fits in the box so you can play around with the actual pins themselves and create your own set of pins and once you create a pin or a template that you like you can replicate it by just over in here you see those three little dots you click on the dot and it says duplicate page so basically you can create multiple pins using the same template as have to do is just basically change the header so to blog in a niche market something like that and you have the option to create as many pins as you want in this example we have the same um, template but basically two separate pins and if you want to create another one let's just add another one for example so this one we're just going to change the header and say something like affiliated niche niche marketing so basically we have created three pins that from one template you don't have to use the same template if you look at the pins that we created before we have four separate pins all looking and feeling different because it's it, it's basically um marketing something or showcasing something different so we didn't use a standard template we created um, four separate templates but four pins all together on this canva platform so once your pins are created and you like what they look like the next step is to go and export them to your hard drive so the way to do that on the right hand side you see the share button you hit the share button and you click download in this case it's asking me it's going to ask you what you want to download 
if you just click on one pin it's just gonna download one pin if we want all four pins to be downloaded at the same time we just basically just click on all four of them and say share and download once they're downloaded they would pretty much be on top of your desktop and once they're on your desktop the next step is to create a carousel pin in Pinterest so the way you do that we we go to Pinterest and in Pinterest we're going to create a new pin and once we create this new pin it's going to ask you whether or not you want to upload the information from your hard drive whether or not it's a, it's a it's an image or a video so we're just going to basically upload the pin so once we click the upload button you see for example we have four pins here that we have created before we can basically add these four pins by just clicking on each each one of them and say open let's use this these four pins to create our carousel so when to do that Pinterest would ask you what do you want to create with these four pins you want to create a collage or you want to create a carousel we want to create this one so we create that click on it and hit the create button once you hit the create button those pins would pop over it typically what we would do we would um, just do the crop into a two to three and say okay let's update based on the crop so you want to view view it to make sure that the pins are in the order that you want them and basically they are doing what we call um, the information on the pin in terms of the 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 breakdown of the titles and everything it's going to be one one title for all four pins so we can say this is how to do affiliate marketing you want to make sure that you update your your description and you can definitely add some alt data to so you can put the same thing here actually instead of instead of doing that I just copy paste uh, once you've done that you put you can um, you can write your description you can say this article is about how to create or how to do for example affiliated marketing read more from the link below once you satisfy with your your header your your description your alt um, information the next step is to basically put in your URL or your your link that you want that pin to be read direct to you have two options like for example on your four so we, this is carousel is have four four separate pins you can put in a URL for each pin separately or you can put one URL that basically will cover off the same that's why I say use the same text and URL for each pin if you don't want that if you want to have separate URL for each pin you click the on I click button and then you put in whatever URL you want so we put like for example dot that smart finders org for this one and then for the next one we can probably have an affiliated link 
So we could put like www dot dot say Amazon whatever dot com. So basically, you can put as um, all four pins. You can put separate URL. But the only thing is that um, you can put separate um, headings or you can put separate description so they're all going to be on the the same description the same heading but they can be redirected to different places so if you are like doing affiliated marketing for five different products you can have your five different url that's in that pin so once you satisfy once you and if you want to use the same url you click back on the the button once you satisfy then you choose which board you want to pin it to and if you say we want to do blog and then you just hit the publish button and that's how you create your carousel pin don't forget to subscribe hit the notification button and thanks for watching